What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Mac 85 here, back with another video. And today, we're doing an interview with uh, Defiant Tez. Let him know who you is, Tez. Hey, Defiant Tez in the building. What's up, Tez? Time out here, man. You heard? You know what I'm saying? He's coming off a big game that just happened today. Uh, I'm finna ask him eight questions, and uh, he's just gonna respond to it. So that's how, basically, this new segment's finna go. So, without further ado, let's just get into it. Alright, Tez, in your first game, dropping 30, how'd you feel like you impacted the game? Um, I feel like I'm testing a point guard, which I usually don't do. But since our uh, starting point guard, while he wasn't there, I had to step in, fill the role, and I think I did a pretty good job. Yeah, he did drop 30. He dropped 30. Uh, did it feel like the defense was kind of getting on you, or was the defense pretty, like, wasn't able to get to you or anything like that? Indiana has a very aggressive defense. I... Uh, I was getting trapped frequently, and when I got trapped, I tried to make a make the great pass to get our offense going. So yeah, and I did see you got mild a bit. There were some calls called, some didn't. How do you feel about that? I mean, I feel like uh, the CCM was pretty laggy, so oh, yeah. I could see other people laggy. Quick was very laggy. He was miling a lot. Yeah. So, uh, but you know, it's a, it's hard on the reps to make. Make good calls, but I just feel like, you know, when it's a mile, we should know it's a mile. Yeah, 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 definitely, definitely, definitely. Um, but yeah, all right then. Uh, next question. How far do you think Houston finna go in the season? I feel like we can go, I mean, at our peak, we can be 14-0, but at our worst, it's just not looking so good. Mm. We have a lot of, we have a lot of great pieces and a lot of players. That can uh, be very special. Yeah. And then other players, you know. You feel like you, Wyatt, he, and Brent could, like, go pretty far? I feel like, yeah, I feel like not just us. I feel like the whole team can go very far because it's the Houston Rockets. So we just have to see what happens and uh, mm -hmm. time will tell. Definitely, definitely. You're right. Um, all right, next question. Which person do you think can win MVP? I feel like, um, as of right now, it's hard to tell. I mean, like, it's week, week two just started, and teams are still getting built, teams are still making moves, so it's hard to tell who's going to win MVP. You know, at the end of the day, me being me, I'd still put myself up there, maybe. Definitely. And have a big season, like always. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Most definitely. You got to have confidence and stuff like that. Yeah, that's true, though. Uh, uh, okay. All right, next question. Um, what skill do you think you need to work on? Um, I feel like I need to um, keep my turnovers as low as possible. Oh, yeah, you want to get turnovers. <laughs> yeah, you need to be getting six, but that's still a lot. Um, Got to keep my turnovers down. Yeah. Um, uh, making sure to talk on defense, making sure my team's playing team defense and all offense, scoring when I have to, facilitating, facilitating when I have to, and you know, yeah, putting points up on the board. You feel like you could be like a leader, kind of type of thing. Yeah, I feel like uh, I've adapted to that role over the course of my career, and now, now later, as I feel like I'm a veteran now, I'm just a natural leader on the team. Mm, so that's definitely. just what I have to do. Yeah, how many seasons you in? Uh, you been in NRBA? In season twelve, so this would be my uh, fourth, fifth season. Fifth season. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is probably my sixth season. Yeah, it's my sixth season. So that's a, season eleven I came. But hey, that's that's great though. You know, I like that leadership type of thing. You feel like you feel like uh, you know, if there's problems, you can call them out and have the confidence to call them out, like you know, locker room problems or on court problems type stuff. Uh, everyone needs to hold themselves accountable and, you know, as a leader, sometimes I'm going to have to say something just to, you know, get the team. Can't can't have lackluster players. Players giving no effort. And, you know, as a leader, I think I need to address that sometimes. But at the end of the day, you need to be self-accountable and everybody has the goal of winning. Yeah. So everybody should be, you know, focusing on their mistakes and make sure they're doing the best they can at all mm -hmm. times. Definitely, definitely. No, I bet. Uh, next question. Uh, 
out of your whole, it doesn't, it don't even gotta be NRBA, just, like, as a whole, like, ever since you've been playing Roblox, I mean, it could be NRBA, it's up to you, but, um, what person do you look up to the most? Look up to? Yeah. Um, like, on, on Roblox, or just? Yeah, on Roblox, everywhere. like, a kind of, like, a high respect for, her, you know? I got respect for, uh, I'd say, um, I don't know. That's a tough one. I mean, <laughs> uh, I got respect for, I got respect for a lot of people in RBA, but like, if I got to name somebody that's like my dude, dude, um, Javon's up there, Bez is up there, even though he's, He's not gonna see an RBA hardwood for another thirty years. But you know, Javon's <laughs> up there. <laughs> Javon's really my guy. Yeah, Javon. You know, everybody dogs him all the time. And I yeah. Dirty Haitian. Dirty Haitian. Yeah. Dirty Haitian. <laughs> dirty Haitian. <laughs> yeah. I fuck with Javon though. 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 Yeah. Um. Next question. Uh, oh, okay, so, you know, we just talked about the most respected, like, kind of, like, respect uh, player that you have. Uh, yeah. This one's the opposite. Which Robloxian do you highly dislike or think is kind of annoying or something like that? Um, I mean, like, I try to not dislike anybody. So, um, I, I don't know how to answer that question. I mean, I, I don't really think... Uh, Bad relationships is healthy, so you know, I'm I'm cool. I'm trying to be cool with everybody, but you know, if you come at me sideways, and that's just gonna, you know, that's pretty childish, but for no reason. So. Yeah. I don't retaliate. I don't fuck shit. Yeah, I feel if you. you. Want to come at me sideways? Yeah. Then yeah. Was there any like? I'm usually friendly with everybody. Was there any like kind of little situation where it got pretty pretty uh how do I say kind of like a nasty like like y'all was talking. Like kind of like like a Roblox fight <laughs> type shit where y'all insulting. Has I been through anything like that in scrimmages or games? Mm, yeah, recent game in it. Uh, this Indiana game. Uh, some some of the players not gonna name names, but you know. Yeah. Uh, we haven't even even though we were winning, which uh, has me confused. But some of the players were just unhappy with one play time and two. Uh, stuff that doesn't really matter, but you know. That's yeah. their problem, and you know, take care of that. Yeah, I feel you. I feel you. Um, all right, this is the seventh question now. Uh, what is the main reason why you won today's game? I said the main reason why we won because uh, we we had a lot of confidence. I I feel like every single player for like. They they uh were the best player on the court at all times, being aggressive on defense, going for steals, and when they had the ball, looking to be aggressive in attack and you know put some shots up. I mean, we didn't hit as many shots as we wanted to. Uh, field goal percentage was pretty low in terms of how we want to be, but you know at the end of the day, shout out to Indiana, they're a good team, but we we came up with a, a W that we needed. Yeah, it was kind of a blowout, low key. <laughs> it was kind of got kind of pretty. How'd you feel about, like, the blowout, like, kind of area? I mean, I guess I, I would love if we can do that every night, no matter who we're facing. Yeah. But it's good it's good to have it now. Man. Yeah. <laughs> How'd you feel when uh, Cookie dropped 15? Ever? When Cookie dropped 15, <laughs> did you did y'all feel some type of way, or was it, like, is whatever? <laughs> Who? Fiji or Fiji? Fiji, I don't know if I say his name. Cookie. Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't really like know who he is, but you know. Oh. Um, Damn. Yeah. Um, <laughs> All yeah. right then. <laughs> okay. Know. All right. This is the last question then. Uh, so after the, after today's game, how did you feel about the YP and Brent situation? Did y'all get that resolved, or was that like? Like, what was kind of, like, the backstory behind that? I mean, um, you know, uh, some, uh, on the court issues, uh, I feel like, you know, um, things, things, can, things were addressed, things were said. Um, problems have to be 
problems have to be solved, and I feel like we can we can get that figured out. You know what I'm saying well, the best the solution will be the best solution for the team going forward. So whatever whatever happens happens. Yeah. You got that? You guys got that resolved, or is that still y'all like straight? I don't know, man. I don't know. You don't know yet. Time will tell. Time will tell. Yeah. All right then. Um. But but hey, that, that's that's all the questions I got. How did you feel about this interview today? I feel like this is a great interview. Um, I, it's probably one of my first ones. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying, but I feel like it was good. What you're doing is good. Um, Thank this you. This is a great interview. Keep keep up the good work, and I, will, I hope to be back back soon. I'm saying. All right, bet, bet. Everybody, that was Defiant Tez with this interview. Uh, I'm going to conclude that after today. Uh, next one will probably be Quake Super or uh, Soaring Air. Uh, keep out for that. And uh, Tez, you, getting, you, got, you, know, you got any shout outs you want to give out to? Um, uh, shout out, shout out Overtime. Overtime? Right now, but uh, <laughs> I'm Who are you shouting out Overtime right now, for? But, uh, <laughs> um, Oh, damn. <laughs> also, keep me in your mind when you're voting for your offensive player, your defense player, your MVP, all that stuff. <laughs> and also, uh, uh, AI's cheating. Denver stacked. All right, I'm out. All right. That's today's interview.